Today's kit. Chloe. That H&M shirt. I got a puncture in here. Some shorts. It's super comfortable. Today we have Pumas. Instead of uh, Adidas. They just look a little bit better. I'm on my way to the library to do research. And uh, meet a friend a little bit later. It's another beautiful day. It's Friday. So yeah. See you soon. Hey, I'm running some errands today and Lush was giving away, apparently today, August 11th, is uh, National Face Mask Day. So this one's called Beauty Sleep. It smells pretty good. Uh, it says it's for like face and body. I don't know. So I thought we'd try it. I don't do face masks very often. But, uh, yeah, I just thought, ooh, the smell is very strong. <laughs> As in most, uh, most products. This is a decent sized container though. Like there's probably enough here for like two or three masks. If you don't like spread it like I am right now. <laughs> actually smells a bit like blueberry. It looks like it too. <laughs> a little bit underneath. <laughs> so yeah, beauty sleep. So I'm gonna leave it on for a few minutes. Let it kind of gelatinate. I'm gonna put a little bit more on my nose, my forehead. I tend to, I have like, I guess normal combination skin. I get a little bit oily. Yeah, it seriously just looks like blueberry. <laughs> I look like I have a strange rash. But yeah, hold tight. We'll, we'll be back. See what this is like. Oh, and I don't have pink shower caps anymore. Sorry. Sorry to disappoint. Anyway. I would recommend. Um, I didn't rinse it fully off because I'm just about to soak in a tub. I've got eucalyptus, Epsom salts, and I find them so good for this heat. Um, so just make the bath. I don't make it hot at all, um, but I also don't make it cold. It's sort of like room temperature, maybe a, a little bit warmer. So I'm going to soak in that and probably finish like rinsing this off, but I liked it. It's good, it smells actually, when you put the water on after it's dried for a bit and uh, you're rinsing it off. Yeah, so it's uh, Beauty Sleep by Lush and it is International Face Mask Day. So thanks Lush, my skin feels great. Morning, uh, not much in the finds department lately. Uh, it's been a bit of a slow week. Yesterday I did find uh, a bag of stuff um, but I just took it and donated it right away because it wasn't anything I wanted. Uh, I did find a dress and a shirt, but they're in the laundry. I'm going to wash them. Uh, you remember me telling you that last night um, I was going to have a bath because I did my face thing? Well, I did find um, a winter jacket. It's a big puffy one. And it might sound weird to collect at this time of year, but I have a storage closet and when I find winter jackets, I collect them and I will donate them to the food bank that I volunteer with in the downtown east side. Once a year, they do this massive coat drive. And so far, I think I have like six or eight. It's crazy. I did find one that I'm keeping. It's a rains one, which means... Um, it's one that's specifically built for our kind of weather out here in the winter, which is a lot of rain and it has a nice puffer underneath. It's really nice. So yeah, I don't know how many more times I'm going to say nice, but I wanted to show you, I uh, saved my bath water and I'm soaking that coat that I found because it didn't smell so great. So yeah, I will take care before I donate things and make sure they're nice and washed and fresh. So it looks a bit weird, but here you go. <laughs> It looks a bit like a body just kind of floating there. <laughs> it's uh, it's a really good coat, so 
yeah, that's this week's finds. Not many, um, but yeah. I'm doing what I can for the people <laughs> when I find stuff and pass it on. We'll see you later. I have found um, perfume bottles, which is interesting because I've been shooting them. So I have this little box of stuff uh, that was given to me to photograph. And I also have um, Sephora was giving out free stuff one day on the street. So I have that. So I've been um, photographing products. Some Biotherm cream. This you've seen in my Instagram feed. Uh, I froze it in a block of ice and photographed it. Prada empty container. And you've also seen this. This I have found. It's lovely by Sarah Jessica Parker. And this is also in my Instagram feed. I found that. Um, these are empty perfume bottles. Uh, I don't know why people are, I put this cap on here because I didn't have a cap. <laughs> and these are the ones that I found this week. Um, white tea by Elizabeth Arden, some Cartier. And even though it's empty, if you lay it down, you can make it look full. And also there's the miracle of Photoshop. And I like this one, this is Guess. It's very, it's kind of, the bottle is a little bit damaged, but again, Photoshop, but it's really, it's really nice. Yeah, I do a lot with that. Yeah, so yeah, the universe has been good. Uh, this is a find from a while ago. I forget to show you guys. It's perfect. I actually just found it sort of laying in a bush in the park behind my plates. I just wanted to flip it over and show you guys the brand in case you're interested. Sunbelt denim. But yeah, it's perfect. It means I have quite a few jean jackets now, but whatevs. <laughs> Okay, so this is the Lionsgate Bridge, and I am afraid to go on it on my bicycle. Sorry, this is so loud. <laughs> so I thought to conquer that fear, I would walk it. So that's what we're doing. We're walking. I just finished the pedestrian part. My head is sweating like crazy. <laughs> So yeah, stay tuned. I'll catch up on the other side. I'm on the other side. I don't know if you can see how sweaty I am, but my entire body is full of sweat. Uh, my legs were jiggly the entire time. It was a bit intense. Uh, I'm not sure I would ride that on my bike. The path is so fucking narrow and not everybody says that they're passing you. Some people just fly by you. Like it's a quarter of the size of a car lane, I'd say. I don't know, I'm bad at measuring things in feet. So yeah, we're just gonna go get a coffee and sit down and maybe walk around the gap for a minute and enjoy some air conditioning. <laughs> I'm fucking sweaty as hell. Anyway, that's it.